Beginning temperature 4.6, 4.6 degrees Fahrenheit. Beginning mileage 12594, 12594. Hello, Polar Bear Challenge members. Four degrees. Got to watch for black ice. Although I don't think there was any. See them squirrels? Ah, cool. I wanted to talk about the press today. The lamestream media. And the fear that they are attempting to put into our asses. Gas prices are going to go up to $3 a gallon. Because OPEC and non-OPEC members have decided to cut back supply. They're not going to produce oil anymore until they get the price back up. You know what? Them stupid fuckers don't realize? That just works into Trump's favor. Why do you ask? Because that puts the oil workers in the United States back to work. You know, like up in North Carol North Dakota. Where they're doing all this uh what do they call it? Shale. Where they're pressing all this oil out of the ground through rocks and shit like that. That just puts more people back to work. Great job, you stupid fuckers. You don't get it. Well, you never have gotten it, but... Go ahead, OPEC. Cut your shit. Go ahead, Venezuela. Cut your shit. All you non-OPEC companies, Cut your shit. Puts more Americans back to work. Puts the North Dakota pipeline back online, doesn't it? As soon as Trump gets back in. Two dollars and two cents a gallon here. Yeah, it's going to go up to three dollars a gallon. Yeah. Anything to try and make Trump look bad, it's all Trump's fault, goddammit. It's all Trump's fault. He's going to put that uh, former Exxon boss as the Secretary of Defense. He hasn't come out and said that that's who he's going to select, by the way. But that's what they want to press. That's the agenda they want to do. Who better than an oil executive from the largest company in the world, ExxonMobil, to put in as Secretary of State? They'll go over and tell them, go ahead, do it. Go ahead, do it. We'll just relax more regulation on our oil industry, and we'll produce more oil for us. It's not rocket science, people. It's not rocket science at all. 
But apparently it's rocket science for for these pecker heads. in the mainstream media because that's what they're pushing now. Oh, yeah. Look what's going to happen. It's all Trump's fault. No, it's not Trump's fault. Obama's the one that stopped the North Dakota pipeline. Obama's the one that stopped the XL pipeline. What you people don't realize is that the more oil we produce, the more money the United States makes as a government. Because we get to tax it. And as long as we're not importing shit, that is a major help. So go ahead, OPEC. Go ahead, non-OPEC. Cut, cut the supply. Go ahead. You're doing us a favor. You're doing Donald Trump a favor. Because he's going to create even more jobs off of your, off of your dumbass greediness. Ah, I'm telling you, this shit never ends. It's just amazing to me how stupid the press is. Really, 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 how stupid the press is. Yeah, we can make Trump look bad. Really? That's all you're going after? Make Trump look bad? As you do this dumbass shit under Obama? Really? Man, this is going to be a miserable cold day. All right. Let me get a box of beer and then I'll give you the ending. Ending mileage 12601, 12601.